Hello. I wanted to share this uh, page. Basically, um, it's creating your own art Bible. And when I say that, it's just like creating your own knowledge base to reference. And I wanted to put it online as soon as possible. I will have to work on making a better image. Uh, I didn't release a video on the on my website yet, but by the time it's released, it will be online. Basically, it's just a Google Doc, which I realized I should open that in a new page. But um, it's a Google Doc that you just uh, make a copy of it. If you get a file, and make a copy. Um, please don't request edit access from me for it. It's only allowing me because I made it. Um, so it has a table of contents and like basically every time well, what you do is you make a heading one here uh, and if you want to make a new section you just start with like a new heading you type text make heading one and here I was keeping the text to 16 you can make it smaller but essentially what you do well you just do that I'll show you an example um, this is another title of a page highlight it, uh, make it heading one, some other text here, although I'm going to make that 16, then you go here and if you click this circle here it'll, up, it'll update it. So if you see it's basically a way to organize your knowledge if you need to reference it. And you could just uh, put it on separate pages and everything is organized here with a table of contents. And like the other idea is that I do suggest that frequently you uh, download it either as a docs or a PDF or whatever you want to. Um, and you could also print it. So the benefit is if you have a three ring binder and those plastic sleeves within it, you could like slip all of the pages to have a physical copy to reference your information from, which I would recommend doing that. And in the event you ever need to update your own knowledge or uh, like make it make it like like an update to a page or something, you could that just then uh, you know you could just print that specific page instead of having to print everything. And you also know what page number it's at because you have your table of contents as like page as the first page or page zero. So yeah, that's what I wanted to uh, share. Um, it should be online soon. I'll probably hone it out more in the future as well. But yeah, thanks for listening. Bye.